Hey everyone, this is David at Finish Line Factory, and I'm at a Ferrari dealership, so I can't be very loud. I gotta be pretty quiet. Uh, behind me is the new 911 GT2 RS. Look at this thing, carbon fiber everywhere. It has a 700 horsepower twin turbo 3.8 liter flat six, and a seven speed automatic, uh, well, the seven speed PDK double clutch gearbox. And uh, it's actually currently the fastest car in the Nuremberg ring. So I'm just going to go for a brief, brief overview, just walk around the car and uh, check it out. So let's go do this. Oh my god. Look at this. This is ridiculous. It's got a huge front splitter. This is a GT2 RS. You do not want to break this. I mean, I can imagine that, you know, a GT3 one or even a standard one could cost a lot, but just the fact that it says GT2 RS means that there's very few produced. And if that breaks, you're going to have a bad day. <laughs> That's for sure. Coming up here, carbon fiber hood. Look at this. With the, with the uh, silver stripe down the middle. And the two NACA ducts. This will probably go into like the brake coolers or some oil coolers or something. In addition, in a standard Porsche GT fashion, the badge is just a sticker. It's got the black headlights with black tinted lenses. It's got these ducts here. These vents for relieving high pressure air building up in the wheel well. And uh, new for the 991.2 generation, these forward vents are a little bit larger to get us to let a little bit more air out. Coming over here, it also has a carbon fiber mirror cap. There's carbon fiber everywhere just to save as much weight as possible on this car. If you look in there, let's see if we can zoom in on it. There's actually no radio, nothing in this car. It doesn't even have, it doesn't even have AC. I'm sure you might be able to spec it with it. But this is a car for the track, not for the street. Uh, but if you're like me, my car doesn't have AC. I still drive it on the street. I just deal with it. Coming over here, this is a new, uh, new piece. So this is a larger vent, larger intake, also made out of carbon fiber. Coming back here, look at the striking rear end. Look at that. This is a beautiful car. Huge rear carbon fiber wing. Look at this. It's massive airfoil. And the uh, end caps painted silver. Right here, GT2 RS badge. Well, sticker. Look at this. There you go. Porsche center lock wheels with the PCCB Porsche carbon composite brakes. I believe this car ran a 646 in the Nurburgring, so that's an absolutely incredible time. You can see this car's been spec with uh, white dials. Let me see if I can. There you go. Look at that. It's carbon fiber all over the dashboard. You can see it around the uh, the key uh, the key slot. Alcantara all over the all over the dash as well. It's topped with leather. You can see the, uh, the stopwatch in the middle. Carbon fiber racing seat. No seats in the back, just carpets. This is really cool. I didn't think I'd be seeing one of these so soon. Here you go, side splitters. Actually, I don't think the side splitters are carbon fiber. So they didn't just deck this whole car out with carbon fiber. I guess it's a combination of lightweight, aerodynamics, and a very powerful engine to help achieve that time. Oh, one more thing. There you go, this extra vent here. And that's actually, actually a badge there. Look at that. It's one badge. And it's actually, it's an actual physical badge. It's not a, uh, it's not a sticker, which is one thing I find kind of a little weird. Huh, cool. So yeah, there you have it. 911 GT2 RS. Over here, F12. Very nice, $329,000. 700 horsepower V12. TDF, F12 TDF. Oh wow. 
Wow. Mileage, 58. It has delivery miles on it. A little difficult to see, but the, uh, the seats are covered in plastic. I think the name of this color might be like uh, Giallo Modena or something. These, these gills cut into the, into the rear quarter panel. There's the carbon ceramic brakes. And the aero bridge on the fender. I don't know if it's not a 4 or 5, it's 4 8 8. <laughs> Whoops. Cars are very similar, so that's okay. Got this very unique front bumper with dive planes in the middle. Front splitter. And I think this has uh, those S ducts that they, they go in this way, come back out, and then go out the, go out the middle. Look at these huge nostrils. Over here. A12, super fast. In black. First one I've seen in black. Four or five eight speciale. And a uh, four five eight, four eight eight. This one has a, a black roof. Look at that. Black roof with white body. And uh, Strasse forged wheels, aftermarket wheels. So there you go. Here's a rare color. This one's blue 458 Speciale. So 488 Spider. 550 Marinello. Check this out. They have a lot of Specialis in here. And oh, is this. Oh, this is a really cool spec. It's got yellow seat belts. This very unique striping on the uh, 488 Spider. Nifty. All right, so I'm outside, and there's a couple more specs that we're going to read to you off of uh, Wikipedia <clears throat> that I missed. So the uh, the GT2 RS, the roof is made of magnesium. Front and rear wings and boot lid are made of carbon fiber and the front and rear apron are made of lightweight polyurethane. The rear and side windows are made of polycarbonate and has a fully titanium exhaust system. So that, uh, that helps to save a lot of weight. So I'm going down uh, to the uh, little area that they have next door and I heard they have a bunch of really nice stuff there. So I'm gonna go check that out. All right, so I'm here at uh, Maserati of Fort Lauderdale and there are some really, really cool cars here. It's a 918. It's actually a Ferrari Enzo, so that's actually the front of the dealership. So I'm just gonna start from the back, work my way there. So let's go take a look around. All right, starting from the back, SLS AMG Black Series. Look at this. Carbon fiber wing. I've actually driven one of these on the track. Very fun. 600 horsepower, seven speed, double clutch. Incredible beast of a machine. What is this thing? I know it's like a second gen Dodge Viper, but... Oh, no way! This is the Viper ACR 133 edition. And that 133 edition, that 133 that actually is, uh, stands for this lap record that the this car set on a racetrack. I can't, can't quite remember which car it was. Which, uh, which racetrack it was. But wow, look at this. It almost looks like a Hot Wheels car with all the, the dual tone red and black body these crazy red wheels and the carbon fiber rear spoiler look at this and it's still got the plastic wrapping and everything this must have like three miles <laughs> oh no way this car must have zero miles on it this is the original window sticker it was just never removed the vehicle was built especially for matthew k rodriguez so matthew i can see your car right here it's a ferrari 488 and a Porsche 918. Look at this. Looks like the battery hooked up. Those are the exhaust ports there. A 488 Spider. S63. This is a 675 LT coupe. Look at this. Dry carbon mirror dry carbon side splitter 
and uh, front splitter and bumper. Very cool. And here you've got the 675 LT spider. Oh, these are both 675 LTs. Look at that. Bugatti Veyron. Look at this. Black on black color scheme. It's on sale for $2 million. $1.9 million. So this is actually a, a Veyron Grand Sport as evidenced by the uh, lack of a roof. But then you can see the interior much more clearly. And the interior is also black, so this is just a whole complete blackout car. And over here is the quad turbo 16 cylinder four turbocharged quad turbo engine, 1001 horsepower. And this, this is a very, very special car. This isn't just any 911. This is a 1973 Carrera RS 2.7 lightweight. Very, very few of these were made. And this car is actually selling for $1.3 million. Look at this. Traditional Porsche, Porsche tradition. The badge is a sticker. And uh, back in the day, in 1973, this was the best 911 ever made. So it's, it's nice to see this in contrast to the GT2 RS that I just saw over at Ferrari. Look at this. Red racing, red racing belts. You can see the Carrera in the negative space there. As well as the huge ducktail spoiler. And the Porsche sticker in the rear as well. Look at that. 1.3 million dollar car. He has a single uh, side view mirror. Actually, does not have one on the uh, on the passenger side. So, if you want to see what's behind you on this side, look out the window. Here it is. This is the Ferrari Enzo. 660 horsepower. There's a 660 horsepower naturally aspirated V12 carbon fiber manifold. It's actually the first Enzo that I've ever seen. I've seen LaFerraris, seen F40, F50s, F50 serial number one. I've seen LaFerrari Aperta, but I've never seen an Enzo until now. This is beautiful. You can see the nostrils there with the huge uh, fans. I guess the radiator must be up here. The fan in there as well. So many little details on this car that you don't notice until you're actually seeing it in person. You can see the carbon fiber all over the dash. Carbon fiber steering wheel. Very cool.